Hey Smashing Kids, I am the presenter and this is Smashing Kid News! Welcome to episode 2 of season 5. Today we'll be talking about trends, 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 trends all day long. We need to critically analyze some things that have been trending right here in the country. So without any further ado, let's get started. So first up has to be Burner Boy. So I don't know if you've heard that Burner Boy has been in through quite a lot. He's been going through quite a lot because he was supposed to perform at the FNB Stadium in Johannesburg and was not able to. Of course, there were rumors that I need to tell you. So the first rumor was that he fired his old sound at 19, which is not make sure. The second rumor is that he did not make enough ticket sales to perform. Both of these rumors are not I'm not make sure because like think about it, why would he fire his old son and night team? And how would Burner Boy not get enough tickets? But then that also means is he is he losing his power? Is he not losing his power? There's so many questions. And the fact that Burner Boy hasn't come back to us and told us what was up, what was going on, and he's, he's definitely not that kind of guy. Like he just keeps quiet. I remember the time when he shouted uh, at the audience for being late. Like he's he's definitely not the type of person to be explaining his feelings and his emotions. So he's just like, you know what? This is in the past, and he's coming back to us definitely on the 16th of December, 2023, to perform again. And hopefully this time he gets enough to get sales. Support your boy, Burner Boy. And honestly, I don't know what's up. There's a lot going on, Burner Boy. And then secondly, we have Miss Seduction. Yeah, okay, we definitely need to criticize this because misadduction is about Bata Hadene and um, who's, uh, who's on this journey of going to a local university you know, before she's you know, too famous and all the kind of rubbish. But then the fact that the tier, I mean, we've already had our big series about a high school girl you know, trying to find her way, and that's Planet Water, and that went into national boy. So, like, Looking at Miss Seduction, it's like Miss Seduction is like <laughs> misinterpreting the mission. I hope it does do well, but like honestly, I'm not I'm not gonna be a fan. So please do tell us on that number on the screen. What's up with Miss Seduction? Watch it for us and tell us. Give us a little bit of a review on that. And then lastly, everybody has to be our very own Julia Sach Malema. <laughs> so this time around is definitely trending. Not because of the, he is trending because of political reasons, but not particularly. So this time, you know how he celebrated his hashtag EFA 10 year anniversary. Uh, yes, so that big party, that amazing party, right? Um, yeah. Apparently, he's he's facing claims from court because there was a cow that was slaughtered that day, and he apparently stabbed the cow like 50 times. So I don't know, it's, it's, it is part of custom, it is part of tradition, but he is facing a trial for that and he has to pay big bucks because it's animal abuse. But honestly, it is it is tradition and it's culture, so I'm not sure if that's going to be his back. As you know, Julius wins every case, somehow, somewhere, but he's going to win anyway. Hey, I don't know. Thank you so much, everybody, for joining us right here on Smashing Kidneys. Make sure to follow us on the socials. Check out our website right there on the socials. Bye.